And another event happening this weekend is something that I promise you need to know about, especially if you are thinking about adopting a new dog. Darlene is here. We're talking about the second annual Dog Days of Summer Adoption event, which was hugely yeah. successful last year. It was very successful last year, and it's even bigger this year. It just keeps growing every single year. So. This Saturday, right here at the San Diego Six Studios in the parking lot, we're going to have 22 different nonprofit rescue organizations setting up their booths and featuring 200 adoptable dogs. Fantastic. So if you are a dog person and if you have even been looking for a dog, we're going to have everything from about three pounds. The, a small the tiny little, tiny little tea yeah, dogs. to uh, Great Pyrenees that weigh in at about 135 pounds. So everything from three to 135 pounds. And what do we if say? You if can't you... find a dog at this event. <laughs> Just face it, you're a cat person. You're a cat person. Yeah. We like to tell you that. <laughs> Nothing I mean, wrong with that. There's right? 200 dogs. Person. Of course you're going <laughs> to be right. able to find one. All right, now you are looking at a bunch of dogs and their owners right here at our San Diego 6 studio. These are all employees of us here at San Diego 6, and these are all success stories because these are employees who saw cute dogs on TV and said, all right, I call that one as mine. Dibs on that dog. Karen, when did you when did you see this dog on TV? Um, I actually saw her online. We were searching online because we knew we wanted a dog, and uh, we found this beautiful okay. dog here, and knew she was the one we had to have her she's so cute okay now she's not a puppy anymore no but she acts like one i see oh very much so <laughs> she's pretty high energy dog high energy dog but a great companion i bet oh of course she's she's so sweet so <laughs> sweet okay let's get over here sean when did you find this cute what's her what's the dog's name rusty by the way? but i got him about nine years ago nine here. years yeah. ago yeah i was sitting Aww. in my office and i saw him in the studio and came over and that was it that was it you yep. fell in love right then and there with yep. rusty how's Absolutely. rusty doing now he's, nine years old seems to be hanging in there so i would have never guessed Really well. Yeah, I know. He's he's a very youthful dog. Still acts like a puppy. He's doing great. Still acts like a puppy. Now, he was one of the dogs featured on our Animal House segment. So he adopted him right here. And if, for people that don't know this, for 15 years now, every single morning, San Diego Six has featured a dog from one of the different rescuers. You've been a part of that so. since the very beginning. Yes, for you? 15 years. I think I'm older than. You've worked here longer than I think all of us longer combined. Than the entire, right. yeah, entire <laughs> no matter staff. what happens to the studio, the dogs Darlene's stay. still here. I love it. Right. All right, let's get over here. Let's talk to Heidi, who's currently dog sitting for a Jane's dog, Mozart. How's the dog sitting going? It's going well. It's going well it's so going far. Well. Mozart's got some energy, though. We're it ready for Jane. Bit. Jane yes. needs to come back from her honeymoon. Jane needs to come back, please. <laughs> and I think this dog was adopted at this event last year. Yes. Yeah, she Little did puppy. find him. Dog yes. days of uh, and summer. At the Holly's Garden booth. So yeah. cute, buddy. What a sweet face. Okay, now I always give Lindsay a hard time for this sweet dog. What's the dog's name? Little Bit? Well, you call her Stinky, I call but her, her name's stinky. Little Bit. I call, sometimes I recommend Bathing bathing Stinky. Uh, that's but Little Bit, little oh, bit is so sweet, though. Is he is he kind of a cuddler? Oh. Uh, no. <laughs> Listen, don't you get close, Jonah. Don't Please. you get close. She likes yeah. to cuddle and burrow and do whatever under the covers. And then... <laughs> it's always the little ones that are the toughest, aren't they? She was found at 7-Eleven. They thought it was a little kitten walking around. And um, <laughs> they got closer and found it was actually a dog. And Don't so worry. I got her in a shelter. We all take turns barking at Jonah with the cameras sometime no, during no, the morning. No, He's no. used to it. Oh, wait, who else is being feisty over here? Producer Maria, who is this? This is Peanut. He's got big man complex right now. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> Peanut. Now, we've had to have an intervention with Maria from time to time on our show yes. because we bring in dogs a lot. And Maria's like, I'll take that one and that one and four of those and <laughs> one with that fur. And um, ha ha the most dogs you've had at one time are? Four. Four. Okay. <laughs> right now you have? Two. Two. Okay. Good. We're so learning. Is it an intervention? It's step an by intervention. Step. But Peanut's very sweet. And thank you for doing your part in rescuing some of the dogs that we feature right here on our show. Thanks. Every right. once in a while we have to ban Maria from the studios. <laughs> right. She's not allowed to look That's over when right. Darlene's doing no her dog dogs. adoption segment. Darlene, one more time. The details on the event for Saturday. Okay. So again, 8253 Ronson Road, right here at the San Diego Six Studios. We're going to be setting up. We'll have dogs here from 10 a.m. until 2 p.m. So just four hours. 200 dogs, 22 local nonprofit rescue groups. Even if you don't want to adopt a dog, come on out. You might find a group you want to volunteer with. And all of these rescues are always looking for foster homes as well. So if it's not time for you to adopt, summer 
is right around the corner. You and your kids need something to do. You might want to foster a dog, foster a litter of puppies. Come meet the group, see who you like to work with, and, and get involved. It's Even, a great way to find out yeah. if a pet is the right thing for your family to That's get involved right. in the fostering program. All right, thanks for doing what you do, Darlene, for Thank 15 you. years now. You've made a big difference. <laughs> Countless you. dogs have been adopted, cats, rabbits, tor tortoise, a bird you brought in the other day. We've had everything. Rabbits, <laughs> no matter what, we, we the put them on. The list goes on. Mm -hmm. All right, thanks, and we'll see you out there on Saturday.